Who is this? It's me. I shouldn't have called. But Patricia! Mrs. Madrazo! Hey! Are you behaving, Trevor? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Patricia, I really miss you. Our time together is very important. I have to go. Hey, man. Fuck. What do you want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know. No. Sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you, you're a killer. You know? You are a man of action. You do not sit on couches. You take scores. You're back, man. We are back. All right? All we got to go do is bust out Brad, and then we're golden, man. Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly does this leave me in the second act of your life? We're going to do this last big job, and then we're going to dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me. All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a fucking family. Yeah, well, I got nothing. No one gives a fuck about me. I do. Oh, fuck you. I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. You're not dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'm your fucking nightmare! Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats! Let me... Let me just ask you something, all right? Something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. 
You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead. You're fucking dead! Oh, fuck. Trevor! Hey! T! Where are you going? You know where I'm going. Fuck you. You don't need to go all the way to North Yankton to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back in my house. Come on. We'll order pizza. Fuck you. Fuck your pizza. Fuck everything it stands for. This is insanity. Oh, no. No, it's clear and reason thought. Finally. Come on. Come back. We'll talk. I'm not going to listen to another one of your lies. Hey, I'll lay it all out for you. Everything. Turn around. I'm going up there to see it for myself. You'll be disappointed. <laughs> well, I'll be something. It'll be an anti-climax. The grave's empty. Just a bag of sand, something like that. Just smoke and mirrors. Ooh, the lies! How do you do it, man? The game is up. I'm trying to save you a trip. You've done me enough favors, buddy, all right? Save your fucking breath. Trevor, come on. Fuck you, Michael. Soon enough, I will. Trevor? It's great to, uh... They're a plane I can use. Get me across country. Sure. Sure. We got one fueled up for a trip south of the border. I'm taking it. Is everything okay, man? Everything is not okay. Nothing has ever been okay, but I gotta see it for myself. I'm gonna see an old friend, all right? You're where I think you are, buddy. I don't know why I didn't see it. I guess... I guess I didn't want to. Fuck! Maybe I knew all along. I'm gonna find out for sure, and I'm gonna do something about it. There's always something wrong with that job. What went down after, I guess. I guess I wanted to believe fucking... Fucking play circus! Idiot! 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 I'm sorry, Trevor.
Who you got in here, huh? As if I need to ask. Hey, you're wasting your time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. The guy who doesn't give a shit? That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? What happens in the dark? Comes out in the light. Oh, give it a rest, Trevor. There's nothing there! Uh, this is it. Moment of truth. I didn't know. Brad! Look, we do what we gotta do to survive. This thing, it didn't work out the way it was supposed to. Oh, and how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin? Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot, I did. That's, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep 10 years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die. You reptilian motherfucker! I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you. Never a truer word has been spoken, brother. Now pull the fucking trigger. You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! 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 Fuck. Joe Phillips! Mr. Joe has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho! I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's it to be? How's it to be? Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? Motherfucker. Come out! Well, y'all. We could have 
teamed up! Me and Trevor, we ain't friends no more! He's getting away! You're out of your element! More vans, of course! Oh, you forgot to check the train schedule! <laughs> Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao. Yeah, the ex-nut. Back down to a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. Ha! <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut out. Your operation causes problem for me. I want to expand into Blaine County, but your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? Michael DeSanta. You live in your trailer together with the maid, and then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety? <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! That's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He will die. Tell him I love him dearly.